Hello and welcome to CRTV. My name is Dazo Danavi. And well, today's uh, episode, I call it a very special one. It's an amazing one because the guy I got here is the Rabuna boy. Yeah? If you've ever heard about this song, then you know who I'm talking about. Team manager is right here, ladies and gentlemen, on CRTV. It is, of course, the youth vibes, and he's going to do his own introduction. You're welcome, bro. Hana kore ki faya banat ketir fi juba kasuru gel batai banat ketir nyakamu minana ketir silu be fananin be aula tajim taki na sade analigo tatai banat ashi kenushi bye bye. Ana silu wa kama na. Ana silu wa minti mana ja ja ma. It's your boy Rabuna boy. I'm happy to be here. Yeah, man. Nice to meet you one more time. You're my guy, man. <laughs> Do you know one thing I love about team manager? He's very humble, very simple. He's the best, trust me. Yeah? That is my own opinion. Yeah? Thank you, thank you. Tell us about yourself, T. Uh, who is team manager? I mean, team manager. Who is team manager? Well, uh, team manager is just an ordinary person. Mm -hmm. You know, my, my, the name, you know, Taban. Mm -hmm. And uh, the word T comes from, you know, Taban. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, before I started music, I was mm -hmm. working in a, a music recording studio. Mm -hmm. That is Highland Studio. Highland Studio. And uh, by then, I was actually the manager. Mm -hmm. So, around the area, people <laughs> used to call me Taban, the manager. Uh -huh. And uh, when I started music, I, I feel like it's just okay, you know, to put team manager just the way people know. Mm -hmm. Yes. You always love to advise people on your music, like... Uh, when I listen to your music, it's all about advice and all that. And you know, it 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 it, it, it actually came as a, I mean, when you came up, you, you really sounded different from other artists who have been doing. The artists who do, uh, you know, when they sing, they do vulgar. They put in vulgar languages, like languages that are not cool. But for your music, it's totally different. Why? Why all about advice? You sound, there are some people always say, say you sound like a church boy, something like that. Why? Well, for me, I believe music is about communicating. Mm -hmm. It's about sending a message out there. Mm -hmm. It's about sharing your emotional experience mm -hmm. with the rest of the people. Mm -hmm. And I always feel like sharing what I've been through. Mm -hmm. And I know a lot of people are always scared of, no, of sharing mm -hmm. their past. True, sure, true. Sure whatever sure. they've been through. Mm -hmm. Maybe they have, you know, a ugly story mm -hmm. to tell people. Mm -hmm. uh, for me, I don't feel like that. I feel like it's okay to tell people where I came from mm -hmm. because it's obvious nobody is born with everything. Mm -hmm. So you, always, you can be born with nothing and then now you struggle. Mm -hmm. And uh, with my song, Rabuna, that was the story of my life. Mm -hmm. There's nothing fake. It's everything in that song, you know, is real. Mm -hmm. And I think that's what makes the song unique from the rest of the songs. True, true. So a lot of people actually gone like through the same things. Mm. And uh, when they listen to the song, it reflects their situation back in the days. Mm -hmm. And they love it. So, and it inspired a lot of people. Mm -hmm. And I'm happy, you know, we're here, man, push it. I can, my dear, man, I can see like these days you're running up and down, you're going to a roar, you're going to hear. <coughs> Bro, what's going on? <laughs> That's amazing. We're making money, man. <laughs> We're making Bro, money. We're making and you're money. not calling me. <laughs> well, you know, there's time. There's time. I for know that. there's time for yes, that. There's right time now. for that. There's time to work and there's time to enjoy. Yeah. So don't worry, man. We're still no, in the I game. Got you, I got you. <laughs> <laughs> it is team manager right here in the building, ladies and gentlemen, and you're watching CRTV. My name is Dazo Danavi, aka the Big D. Yeah. And this is one special episode trust me it's a special one and i love it let's go musical yeah and we'll be talking about the rabuna song it is coming on your screen keep it there Django. Django. Kisa de muimle ana wita, ukisa de sukeru windu mana kebir, o kebir via yata nina, abuta isa kala skerita dola, mea to talata ali fisha, abu bi ufam wele shwalta de geek, akil fi beta tu bita muskila, lekin mafi muskila, mata kore rabuna gainu, ita fi zurup wele ita pitap. 
Pata kore rabu na gaino Damana na sukera na geni dugu dugu Wana zadu kan kumsari Ayakan sabu, ayakan sukun Laki nana mabi feki And everything you do Kudu fibala take rabu na gaino In everything you do Kudu fibala take rabu na gaino Manana sukera na geni dugu tubu wana zadu kan kumsari Aya kan sabu, aya kan sukun laki nana mabi feki Manana sukera na geni dugu tubu wana zadu kan kumsari Aya kan sabu, aya kan sukun laki nana mabi feki Utanin biguli tama babi nujua Utanin biguli tama bibi warabia Utanin biguli tama bibi Chocolate in my feet, muscular. Mata kore rabu na gaino. Ita kanta boda wala tamatam. Ita kana dala wala kanga firi. Sakal se di rabu na gaino. Ita kan sukar wala ita kan kebir. Sakal se di rabu na gaino. Ita businessman wala ita askeri. Sakal se di rabu na gaino. And big up to the assholes, yeah. My homie Chris Levy. I mean, pain meaning nothing to something. And everything you do, could do fiba la take rabu na gaino. And everything you do, could do fiba la take rabu na gaino. Zamana na sukera na geni dugu tubu ana zadu kan kumsari. Aya kan sabu, aya kan sukun la gina na mabi feki. Well, that's an amazing piece from uh, my boy, team manager right here. It is called Rabuna. Yeah. Whenever I listen to that song, there, there's a message. There's something special about that particular song. Yeah. Watching the video itself alone. Yeah. You feel like there's something special about the video and as well about the song. Tell us about this song, team manager. Rabuna. So, so the thing, the song came when I finally understood that in this life, when you try so hard, mm -hmm. things can, you know, eventually change for you. Mm -hmm. And I composed the song actually when I'm in a situation mm. uh, that at least thing has a little bit changed for mm. me. I was not in the same, like not the same taban that I used to be mm -hmm. some days, like some years ago. Mm -hmm. So I was driving, sometimes live in a good hotel, sometimes yeah. eat something nice. Yeah. So and then I feel like, okay, now if I can make it, anybody out there can still make it. Mm -hmm. And uh, I feel like I share my own, <clears throat> you know, story. my own story mm -hmm. with the rest of the people. Mm -hmm. Now the, the, the best part about this song is some people, they don't see your struggle, mm -hmm. okay? Mm -hmm. They will start, you know, saying things, this one has done this, has sacrificed they this, they joined the Illuminati. They, 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 they will see the success mm, and then they will start they questioning. Yeah, yeah, they don't know where you come from. Yeah. And that's why exactly I shot the video, uh, just the thing that I've done in the past. Mm. I have to put them in the video so that they watch the video and they know, yes, this guy has come a long way. Mm. Yes. But have you ever been a conductor? Yes, I did. Here in Juba. <laughs> <laughs> it's the manager. If you are a conductor out there, yeah, just know it is not the end of the life. Things may change, yeah? Right. Like what team manager said. Why, uh, I mean, that song, you, you uh, I mean, the, the remix you made with uh, Check B Magic. That song has been an old song, but honestly, you actually woke up the giant. Yes. Yeah. Why that song? Why not any other song? It, there are other songs like other songs that has been there in the game. Great song that actually you right, know, faded, faded up. Yes. Like the 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 Arabi Mafi from you know, they they are great songs. Why that song? Why that particular song? You song? see, they always say good things take time, hmm. and I don't see that song as a faded song. It's okay. a song that people still love and they still listen to it. Mm. Uh, but when when we came up with the with the idea of doing a remix, mm. you know, me and my brother Shakbi, he called me actually one time. I was like, "Yo, T, what's up? Let's 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 get in the studio and do something, man." Mm. Mm. I said, "Man, I was a big fan." Mm. Uh, to, to to be to be sincere. I was actually a big fan of Chuck B yeah. before I even started music because oh. I started in 2018 when the, that song was already out. It was already, it was yeah, already working. It was a hit song. So time. I yeah. told him I was already your fan, and then I think it's a good time, you know, to work together. Mm. And so 
before we get to the studio, mm. we, he, he called Kamba because Kamba is one of the producers that, you know, work with him most of the time. Mm. So he called Kamba and he said, you know, I want to get to the studio mm. and uh, do something with team manager. And uh, mm -hmm. on the way to the studio, mm -hmm. we played the song because I was listening. That's so cool. And then uh, he was like, man, and instead of doing a press project, why don't we do this? Mm -hmm. Why don't we remix this? Let's song? just remix this. Mm -hmm. And then we call Kamba like, yo, man, we have decided to make a remix of uh, Soko. Of Soko. Mm -hmm. Kamba didn't have the data. He lost it a long time what? ago. You know, that six, yeah, 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 sure. six years. It's been it's an old yeah. song, but still sounds so And fresh, so, yeah. you know what I like about Kamba? Mm. is a producer that still remember everything that he has done. Sure. So he still remember all his touches in the song. What? Yes. So he started kicks, from a fresh? From, that was a fresh project. That's wow, nothing like my goodness. Beads or whatever. He said, man, I still remember everything about the song. You guys just come. I went to the studio. We sang it again. Boom. So it means that, nice. uh, uh, I mean, uh, Check B Magic yeah. sang the song from, 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 the from, from the scratch. There is nothing from the scratch. What? We sketched the beat from zero, my friend. But it really sounds like it that sounds song that I used yes. to listen to, like that hit same. song. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about, uh, you know, there's rumors going around in, in, in town right now that yeah. you are dating... Um, uh, you are now clashing with your, you know, yeah. MT7, mm -hmm. that you are dating uh, uh, Juna Desta. Is yeah. that true? Are you guys dating or well, what's going on? You know, Juna is my colleague. Okay. She, she's an artist and she's my friend too. It's not about music only. We, we are good friends mm -hmm. and, um, you know, uh, there's nothing like a relationship, but we love each other. But it's cool to say. It's cool to say you, you can understand. Drive. When it's I say fine. we love each other, uh -huh. it means there's that friendship that you know beyond, uh -huh. and then we call it love. Okay. So what? yes, <laughs> <laughs> I know you don't get it. But I got you. I got yes, you. I got right. you. I got you. Yeah. I got you. Uh, maybe so, somebody's watching is, is, is doesn't get this. But <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> Just break this thing, like you know. What I mean, this um, relationship that is being yes, boy you know, lover when we, when, when we talk about love, like that, yeah. love is it always you know. Uh, categorizing the two mm. you know loving someone just the way he or she is mm. that is just a natural love yeah okay that's someone that you don't have a first you know to do with mm. that is the love i'm talking about she's the my friend love. my best friend and i love her and she loves me that's it D. <laughs> <laughs> when you're always working with her like <laughs> anyways oh. it's cool yeah but but we are going to watch this space you know we'll find out yeah right. we'll find out right. whether this is well, go on, do your research. <laughs> <laughs> it is team manager right here in the building, yeah? And you're watching CRTV. T, what, what can you tell those who are, you know, struggling, they want to come to where you are? You know, you also struggled like them and yep. now you're here. Yep. But the guys out there who are trying this, they're trying that, they are really, really struggling, but it is not working for them. Yes. What uh, advice do you have for these so guys? So, my advice to those who are still, you know, struggling out there mm. the thing is you first have to love what you do mm -hmm. because when you love what you do you have to wake up every morning mm -hmm. and do something about it mm -hmm. okay mm. you love your work now the second thing there are people that you look up to people mm. that you want to be like mm. you always no no i want to be like if you want to be like team manager you want to mm. be like md7 you want to mm. be like john shop mm. you look at the person and then you humble yourself, okay? Mm. Respect that person, <laughs> not only that person, but people that are in the game, especially music. Mm. You must respect those artists that are, you know, mm. started away before you. Yeah. Because you needed to learn something from them. Sure. Okay? Yeah. That is number two. Now the third thing is commitment. Mm. I know a lot of people there, they don't really care how talented you are. Mm. And they won't even notice. They will not even allow you to know that they love what you do sure and it's you yourself you know to keep proving yourself you know that you and you keep improving too mm. you make sure you do something better than what you have done yesterday yeah, sure so that is this, these are the rules for myself mm. i have my own rules mm. but i i don't i don't post people to do what i do because we all have our own different mm. you know unique ways of doing things mm. but not only with music but with everything you do in life mm. you must have this thing yeah okay you must respect other people you you don't hate other people's success mm. when your brother succeed 
appreciate it, celebrate yeah. it. Definitely before you know, yours is going to just arrive. Talking about success, I've yeah. seen uh, single D. Yeah, I call that a success because that has never happened in South Sudan music. Yes. Single D has been nominated for a Frima. And um, I mean, you as well as well been working so hard. Right. Yeah. I mean, do you see yourself, I mean, uh, I mean, do you see yourself you should have been part of this? I mean, should have been nominated? Well, when we talk about awards, awards are just things that are made of. Mm -hmm. And, uh, and uh, to all the artists that are not nominated, mm -hmm. don't feel like you are anything less, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. Let me talk about something. When you look at Grammy Award, mm -hmm. have you ever seen Ekan winning or even nominated? Mm -hmm. And Icon is the biggest yeah, in the worldwide. It's bigger than Banner Boy, it's bigger than anyone, it's bigger than Whiskey. It's bigger than. It's bigger than okay? Uh, Peace and you have seen those, well. of, yeah. uh, those of Banner Boy, those of uh, Whiskey winning recently. Yeah. Okay, so awards sometimes, sometimes you, you have to, some people they, they even do it in a very, very useless way. You mm -hmm. have to bribe people to be nominated, you have to be nominated through, uh, through uh, connection, mm -hmm. through friendship. Mm -hmm. But that's not what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. what I'm, uh, when we talk about single D, mm -hmm. we all know in the country. Yeah, yeah. Single D is a complete artist. Yeah, yeah, sure. Okay? Mm -hmm. Not just like the rest of the artists who are just gambling. Mm -hmm. It's a complete artist and it deserves to be nominated. True. Uh, with this song, Focus, last year, so that song, song has yeah. been doing so well. One, yeah. And we all appreciate the fact that it's nominated. Mm -hmm. uh, for me, I don't feel like I'm not, I don't deserve nomination. Mm -hmm for Afrima Awards, not only Afrima, the rest of yeah, the awards. Award, yeah. So I can say I deserve to be there. Mm -hmm. But if I'm not nominated, that one does not make me like I'm, I'm, I'm anything less mm -hmm. sure, or sure. I don't deserve mm -hmm. the award. Mm -hmm. But I knew the time will come for that. Great. So that's it. That's how I feel. <laughs> okay, what's, what's your last word to our viewers who are actually watching CRTV right now? And um, what can you tell them? Well, my message out there to the people who love music, mm -hmm. because for us, we focus on music, man. Those who love music, you know, it has been different. Mm -hmm. Like uh, from two years ago to now, you guys has really been, you know, supportive. Sure. That's the music. Sure. Sure. And we do appreciate that, but we need more effort from you. Keep supporting your own artists. Not me, not Singoli, not your frog, but any artist that is really doing well. Mm -hmm. You see, there's one thing that I witness in many events, and uh, which is not really good. Mm -hmm. uh, most of the fans that go, you know, goes out to you know attend the shows. Mm -hmm. Will only sing, maybe scream, maybe vibe with artists that they know, or the artists that come from their side. <laughs> okay, <laughs> and then, 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 and even if they know this artist is big and he has, he's like he's having a lot of hits mm -hmm. in the country, they and he's not from their side. They just they keep quiet. They, 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 just they, keep just quiet. they don't want to do anything. They don't want to show that oh they my. even know anything about this artist. Oh my. So this thing must stop. Support whoever deserves your support. Sure. Okay. So that anytime we cannot feel disappointed or feel like ashamed of ourselves. Mm. We, we never know anytime, you know, one of the artists might be recognized internationally and mm. they call him for whatever, either mm. it's a, a battle mm. or either it's something to do with African or mm. international artists. Mm. Then at the, at, the, at the moment, they disappoint us. So we have to be very, very critical when it comes to, you know, supporting the artists. Support who deserve the support, not just because your friend mm -hmm. come from your state or come from, no. You're right about that. Yes. Anyways, before you, you go, uh, the South Sudanese music, okay, uh, yeah, I, I can't say this, but I want you to say it. Yeah. Uh, I mean, for the past few years, at least there's some changes. What, what do you see about South Sudan music? Well, I see a big change. There's a big change, but still we have one problem. We don't have a specific language to use in our music. No right? music. We don't even have a specific general. General. We so use. these things are really affecting our industry. Mm, like when you go and to this, and this is the reason now when someone come, uh -huh. when you, like most of the shows that are done in Freedom Hall, mm. when you see people that sing in a language that we think. Mm. It is a national language, which mm. is Arabic. Mm -hmm. People like Hard Life Avenue stars, people mm. like Crazy Fox. Yes, you know, people look at them just like this. They are not artists. And when Mago Boy come, or really? someone who sang all the <laughs> you will see the crowd. 
<laughs> oh my guy look or whatever whoever who sang him you know in, in, and, and then a certain language yeah. so that's that's the problem that mm. is the biggest issue people mm. don't people don't know what kind of language is, is specific for music and you know people are just gambling there and there you're right but by the time we settle that that's mm. the time we'll know who is really a good singer and who is not sure yes i appreciate you team manager for I coming over it. It's always love. Love, man. Man. Yeah. <laughs> this is my guy. Thank you so much for watching us right here. Yeah. And I say bye bye. Remember to actually subscribe to our YouTube channel, it is uh, City Review Digital. And as well on Facebook, we are CRTV. Follow us and like our page. It's a bye bye from me and team manager. Bye bye for now. Bye -bye. It's love, man.